Cyber threats never stop. They keep evolving and they can strike at any time. But that's why we're here. We're the Security Operations Center and we exist to protect our customers through our intelligence-led approach to security operations. Yes, we have the technology to identify risks, but we also have the expertise to analyze the data we get and to turn that into action fast. Want to see how it works in practice? Come and listen in. Morning. How it's happened? Oh, hi. We've had a CVE which has been added to a new exploit kit. And as you can see, this is all based from the information and criteria that we previously set up. And as you can see, it's exploiting that Adobe Flash Player. What's the risk score? It's 99, so it's very critical at the moment. Okay. All right, thanks. I'll take it on to the CTI team. New uh, Flash vulnerability has been added to an exploit kit. Okay, what version of Flash is it exploiting? Uh, 18, 19 and 20. Okay, I'll uh, validate the alert. I've got a feeling it could be rig. Okay. I'll see if we can get any new IOCs for the analysis guys. Okay. Can we get a scan underway? Oh, we're going to need to put a threat advisory together as well. I'll get someone on that. What about the scans? We can run a scan across the entire estate. Are we okay. looking for specific versions of OS, uh, specific software versions. Okay. We're talking about versions of Flash in this case. In that case, we can use SCCM to identify vulnerable assets as well. Okay, thanks. With the threat spotted and the information scrutinized, we're ready to analyze it. Once the results of our analysis are in, we can take action. We know what to prioritize and what to patch, and we can put proactive blocks in place. And then we can explain it all to you. I've just sent you a report on a threat advisory. Can you let your customers know, please? Yeah, will do. Hi, Susan. Yeah, it's Pete here from Fujitsu Security Operations Centre. Yeah. We've had an alarm fire for a new flash vulnerability. Yeah, we've scanned your estate and there are 78 devices that are vulnerable. So we've created an emergency change to get them all patched. We've also searched back through the logs and there aren't any indicators of any system compromise there. So, and we've set up an alert to monitor for any future occurrences. So I've put all that into a report for you and it should be in your inbox now. Yeah, let me know if you've got any questions. All right, thanks, bye. You can't avoid cyber threats, but you can monitor them, prioritize key ones and take action. That's our job, keeping one step ahead through intelligence-led security. It's all about minimizing risk, so our customers have peace of mind.